Can the extinct Tasmanian tiger return? Genetic engineers hope so. A team of scientists said it has started the de-extinction process of the thylacine, or the Tasmanian tiger, after it was eradicated by human hunting nearly 100 years ago. Dallas-based Colossal Biosciences, a genetic engineering and de-extinction company, said the animal was native to Australia and had roamed the earth for millions of years. The Tasmanian tiger, a striped marsupial carnivore, was thought to have gone extinct after Benjamin, believed to be the last member of the species. Died in captivity in the Hobart Zoo in Australia in September 1936. The company said it will use gene editing, changing the DNA of a living organism to bring the Tasmanian tiger back to life. They further hope to use advanced technology to preserve the species. The company said bringing the thylacine will help rebalance the Tasmanian and broader Australian ecosystems. Scientists said the ecosystems have degraded since the tiger went extinct, which led to the spreading of diseases and an increase in wildfires and invasive species. They claim the thylacine hunted and killed non-native predators that fed off of plants and trees critically needed to sustain natural vegetation. Our family remains dedicated to supporting conservationist efforts around the world and protecting Australia's biodiversity is a high priority. The Tossa Tiger's extinction had a devastating effect on our ecosystem and we are thrilled to support the revolutionary conservation efforts that are being made by Dr. Pask and the entire Colossal team.